welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to make an ube champorado and also I'm going to make cheese stick to go with it so this one at the moment what I'm doing is I'm I'm cooking the rice till it get really really soft with each I use a glutinous rice and a semi skim milk I did not use a coconut milk because I find it very rich especially I have a daughter and sometimes she can be very sensitive with food so yes so before anything else I'm going to keep cooking this rice until it's ready to add the other ingredients as you can see guys this rice uh, glutinous rice is now bubbling actually I've used um, one liter of four percent less path milk to cook the glutinous rice and now I am going to show you the the rest of the ingredients that I'm going to use first ingredients I'm going to use is an uber powder which is pure blend um, this is quite sweet as well so bear in mind when you're using sugar into your um, champorado okay and then I'll be using a ube halea which is four tablespoon yes I'm saving some of it because it's too expensive here ube especially the real one and it's very hard to find a real ube here as well so four tablespoons is enough and then I'll be using an evaporated milk later on to serve it well it depends on my kids if they want um, milk and then I got two third cup of granulated sugar here I am not going to add more um, less sugar for me is the better and also I'm going to use vanilla essence probably a tablespoon just for an extra flavor it's bubbling away and I can't wait so what I'm going to do guys is while I'm waiting for this to cook which is I think maybe another 20 minutes I'm going to make my cheese stick And don't forget just keep it stirring it guys and then leave it for a few minutes and stir again just to make sure that it's not going to stick underneath because we don't want any burn taste into our champarade our way which is i only put it in number two i have a gas cooker which is digital so it's very easy to control the fire now i'm making my cheese stick while i'm waiting for the glutinous rice to cook and i'm going to show you what type of cheese i'm using which is the cathedral city mature cheddar cheese um, it's very tasty and i'm using a spring roll wrap and what i did is i cut the cheese into stick and then wrap it and then I'll use egg wash to seal the wrap. Finger crossed, it's not going to burst because mostly cheese it will. And then I'll use egg wash. Okay. I prefer to use egg wash than water because egg wash are sealed. They are properly. Obviously, while you're making this, don't forget to skip stirring your glutinous rice. Honestly, guys, I only use one cup and it's already multiplied into four, I think, or more. And I think the, I've used a liter of milk already. And I also add um, two cups of water because I don't want to use more, more milk. I think um, one liter is enough otherwise it's going to be very rich which is I don't like I don't mind it creamy but not too creamy okay. here is my finish um, just stick is quite big yeah I like it um, 
because I like the crispiness you know when after you fry it I like the crispiness of the wrapper so I'll make it big okay so as of now guys um, still not quite ready yet but to be honest with you I think this is more likely look like um, rice pudding I love rice pudding by the way so I'm going to cook for another five minutes and then I'm going to add the rest of the ingredients now guys um, I added more water and I actually changed my pan because um, it keeps expanding So it's very creamy even though I added water um, but it's still creamy which is I prefer and at least it's not too rich so I'm just putting it into a high heat at the moment and just to get it bubbly again but at this stage what I'm going to do is I'm going to add my dissolved ovi powder Ube. Actually, this one is already been given by a friend of mine. So, hindi ko po siya binili. So, kung magtatanong po kayo sa akin kung saan ko binili yung ube powder, hindi ko po alam. Kasi binigay lang po sa akin. Okay, look at the color, guys. It's beautiful. Well, and then I'm going to add the vanilla essence which I don't normally use um, measuring spoon because vanilla you can't go wrong with vanilla actually the better the merrier, merrier because you get more flavor I just love the flavor of vanilla in the ube when I make my own uh, ube halaya as well I always add vanilla essence and I prefer vanilla essence than vanilla extract as well so guys and then I'm going to add my ube halaya ay ang sarap niya malapot siya, malagkit malalaman mo talaga na puro ang ube ng halaya pag malagkit that's why I don't buy them in a jar kasi hindi ako magpapaloko sa kanila, hindi siya tunay lasa siyang kamote by the way And then I'm, now it's all bubbly again so I'm going to lower it down again to number two setting my fire look at that guys wow mm. just make sure that the ubi halaya is totally incorporated to the glutinous rice but it would be nice to have that lumpy um, ubi halaya in it anyway, but because it's not a lot, so I might as well just make sure that it's all incorporated. Yeah, look at the color, it's so vibrant. I love purple. It's not my favorite color, but I love the purple coral in food, especially with this, with the flavor. Um, it's actually smell ube oh my god i'm so excited i'm not even had my breakfast and lunch i went diet but it's okay because i still have to do my exercise later on again so i think it's all okay now so the next one guys is i'm going to add my sugar but i'm not going to add it all because I'm going to taste it because I don't like it sweet just probably half of that and then I'm gonna try it make sure that it's all the sugar is all incorporated wow I'm going to 
things if the sweetness is right mm, cool pa so I'm going to add the rest of the sugar Ay, grabe, ang sarap. Oh my God, I think I'm going to have a big bowl. Just imagine having this. I'm going to have this in the garden. It, um, beautiful day today, but it looks a little cloudy outside. Oh my God, it's so good. And again. I don't like too sweet so all I have so all I have to do now guys is I'm gonna keep this for another 10 minutes to bubble you know just to, to reduce the fluid because I added a lot of um, water but still okay because if you can see you still can see the grain of the glutinous rice so they will expand more While you're waiting for that, I'm going to fry my cheese steak. Okay, I'm going to hit um, the pan first for a few seconds before adding a vegetable oil. Vegetable oil. Vegetable. Vegetable. Or veg oil. Right, is, I'm going to put it in full number nine. I'm very impatient because I'm so hungry. Okay, I'm going to load the heat into number five setting because I'm going to add oil. I'm using a vegetable oil, guys. Like I said, I'm not gonna use a lot. It's just enough to cover the pan, really. That's all I need. A bit more actually because i'm frying i think 21 i'm going to fry 21 cheese sticks so it's all right i can always add extra vegetable oil will love it because she is so picky she is very hard to please when it comes to food guys she's very lucky her mom can cook right that is i think that will be hot enough please welcome to my sick i okay na siya pwede na siya ganyan lang okay yung magdikit Please walk in the mansik, but I don't put on metal sick. Poka in that sick, she's going to come back. I like it. Think about it. You'll be eating that creamy, nice ube champorado with cheese steak. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to sprinkle the grated cheese as well on top of my ube champorado and 
obviously what I don't want to need is I'm going to grate the cheese. Where's my cheese? And where's my grater? I think I'm going to cover my champorado because tumatalsik na siya guys kasi wala na yung fluid at natatamaan niya ako don't like it or kahit naka long sleeve ako pero at eto naman bakit para ko nag-iinarte cheese ka lang ha huwag ka mong inarte sa akin ako ang amo dito at ako nagluluto sa iyo Ayan, guys. Sana hindi siya pumoto. Kasi it would be nice. It would be the stuff that she's inside, you know, melt. Para magandang presentation. Siyempre. Maarte kasi ako when it becomes a presentation. I don't like food that you can just slap it in the plate. O, ganyan ako ka-arte. Mag-react kayo dyan. Wala akong pakialam. Okay. Kaya hindi masyadong masarap ang food guys Pag magandang presentation Carry na yun Carry bell siya Carry, carry, <laughs> carry Ay, buhay So ginabilisan muna Para makakain na kami At Hungry na ang aking mga ginakis Mga ginakis As if ang dami kong anak Cheesy Ove Champorado with my cheese stick. There you have it, guys. And it's very easy to make. Very easy. 